This video is basically about how uh, Engineers Day is on board and you know how I'm trying to follow these guys and uh, let's see how uh, you know what all I can learn new. What's up guys welcome back to another day at sea and today we are in the engine control of our ship and uh, I decided that today what I'll do is I'll uh, go around with the engineers and check out what they exactly do and uh, in the beginning we just had the had our lunch and now uh, these guys they are fixing up the plan for today and that's the second engineer you must have seen him in the bunker operations and that's another third engineer Shetty you know him and that's my batchmate Pratyush who is going to uh, do something on the sewage tank today <laughs> <laughs> what happens is every day the duty engineers keep changing and today Abhishek he is our duty engineer yeah. and uh, the guy from Dehradun yeah a, lo yes. a lot of people ask me about him right I don't know if there are many seafarers <laughs> from Dehradun or what but he is the guy from Dehradun he is my senior and from the same college actually uh, three of us four of us Half from Tulani <laughs> and now Vinay he is also uh, half from Tulani and uh, he is waiting for some Amit guys yeah? <laughs> Guys I don't know about you but our second engineer he loves crackers and uh, most of us we don't like crackers because there is hardly any taste So Vinay why do you like this cracker? <laughs> This Skyflex, only he is having it. I think uh, in this the entire ship. This was the only biscuit we used to get when we were cadets. Ah, oh, that's why. This is the engine control room of the ship. And from here, all the parameters, as you can see, many monitors over here are being uh, looked after for all the time. And uh, so you've seen the bridge and the telegraphs, right? So there's one telegraph over here, this, which the engineers they have for reference. And uh, right now, they we have the command on the bridge. And we can switch over from these panels over here. This is the repeater panels and fire panels, and yeah, basically uh, it's uh, integrated with the bridge. And uh, yeah, and now uh, one of the third engineers just told me that this is the generator panel. And from here they are monitoring all the uh, parameters for the generators. This is our storeroom, and uh, you can see the fourth engineer, second engineer trying to find some spares. Yeah, basically a lot of spares. A lot of spares are kept over here for uh, the engine as well as a bit of deck side as well. And uh, you can see the duty engineer Abhishek. He is trying to he can find from the inventory over here. You know what all is kept where. So it's quite handy. So guys, as you must be knowing, engine room is a very loud place to work in. So uh, we use earmuffs or these uh, ear plugs at all times. And uh, yeah. Uh, I have shown it in one of the Musk videos as well. If you haven't checked it out, please check that out. It's on the Musk official website. And yeah, I'll wear this and let's go down and check what the engineers are up to. Yeah, 
Sai team, they are signing off after 11 months. After how many 11 months, sir? Yeah, we come 11 months. Finally, 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 these guys are signing off. Yeah. And Hi. Yeah. You have. And Thai Embassy has finally approved their sign off, and it took a long process. And from London, uh, yeah, that's from London to uh, that's our pay. That's it up. Got it up. And after that, after that, Bangkok team. Ah, uh, Bangkok. Yeah. Okay. Oh, and then Pattaya. Yeah, Bangkok. <laughs> and then party time. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you guys for uh, you. being on board for so long. Yeah. And uh, guys, it's uh, really awesome that they stayed here for so long. And yeah, thank you again. And yeah, thank you, you thank you. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Akshay and Vinay, and they, we both will go to the. We three of us will go to the cargo hold to uh, fix the valve which is leaking. And Akshay, he uh, made a toolbox ready for the uh, for the valve which we will go and fix in the cargo hold. And before uh, conducting any uh, operation or you know uh, work. All of us, not, I mean, not me, but all the engineers, do a toolbox sweep so that uh, you know they discuss all the safety things, all the safety things required, all the parameters which have to be kept in mind, and you know what is the work description and how you will do it. So uh, that is the most important thing before uh, going for any job. So these are the rags from which you know we do all the cleaning, and yeah, we segregate all the clean rags and as well as the oily rags which are disposed of at uh, shore. I have to wait for the workshop. Mein. This here is the visual, si visual signal for you know uh, to, to see if there is any telephone or any alarm so this starts flashing. So this is really important because in the engine room the noise is so much so you need some visual guidance. <laughs> <laughs> he is really uh, upset that when I you know, abandoned him and uh, yeah, sorry for the bad language. But yeah, let's go with the, for the cargo hold thing. Vinay, what was this uh, sewage thing you were doing right now with both engineers? Yeah, we normally have this uh, disinfection by ultraviolet light. So, one of this uh, UV sensor that was, uh, you know, it was, yeah, yeah, it was uh, not working. We are we thinking of replacing it. Okay. Because we were opening it. So now we are going to the cargo hold. Yeah, we will go to the cargo hold. We will go to the cargo hold and yes, Akshay, he is with the helmet now and he got the helmet for Vinay. Yeah, so and always helmet on. Helmet on, on deck. safety first. And I like the concept of this ear mask with the helmet. Yeah, and so uh, put them on. Quite, quite handy, you know, you can see uh, just flip on, flip off. And these ear plugs are also good, but I think this is much better. Yeah, for in the room. Guys, finally we are in my area, that's the deck area and I feel like I'm back at home. This engine room was like totally new thing, you know. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, we're going now for the cargo hold and there's a ladder and everything. And guys, we've got rough weather. Irony of the sea, it's raining but still guys are washing. <laughs> guys, I will show you this. What the shit he just said. It's raining and... These guys are still doing washing. My god. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> guys. These guys are washing somehow and I don't know why because it's raining. It doesn't make any sense. And just see how rough the seas are right now. We've got some really big swell, maybe 3 or 4 meter swell right now. You cannot see it from this level but you can definitely feel it on the vessel. So now we are going to enter the cargo hold and fix the valve. And uh, yeah, it, you see it's not an easy job being an engineer. You have to uh, you know, uh, take care of the engine room as well as the things on deck which are machinery based. So We just came down and now we have to go up after travelling a little distance. So guys the struggle over here is that there is yeah, there's very little ventilation and also you can't reach to the bridge. Yeah. So if you have to operate, you have to operate these ones locally or you need two you or three guys to relay the, relay the message, message from here to the bridge because this can be opened from the ICS, the computer which Vinay has shown in other videos. 
and now they will work and what is the work we have to do today here? we can open it manually also we can open it manually also okay and what is the work we have to do here? Uh, this this van was changed and now the actuator is leaking so we need to figure out what is actuator is uh, yeah actuator is actually the uh, the device that will move this valve so They are, I think, repositioning the valve. What are they doing now? They are aligning it. Aligning the valve and then they test it from the top. Right now we are going to put the LPU back and after that let's go up and then test it. They have put me in my work. Where is it? So guys, finally they managed to do the LPU thing and it's working now. And they they, I think I was a good help for them. Yeah, guys, that's the scene from the forward. It's quite, quite rough, and yeah, I don't want to stay here too long because the ship is moving in a very uh, weird mat manner. So, guys, that was a day in the life with the engineers, and uh, I'm back in the ECR now. And yeah, that was uh, more or less. Uh, it was a good, different experience I had today. I must say, it was fun and, and as well as challenging. And life is not so easy being an engineer, guys. It requires a lot of physical strength, and uh, the gym I do, I guess, for the engineers, it's just a normal routine thing. So, <laughs> kudos to them. So, in the next video, I'm going to be talking about. No, I'll be giving you a tour of the engine room, the entire tour, and uh, I'll what I'll do is I'll ask second engineer to you know give us a better insight. In any case, if you did like the video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you back another day. Uh, I'll see you back another day, Archie. Thank you.